channel so today I am going to be showing you what I how I did my makeup in I think 2020 era and how I do it now in 2022 believe me there is like a total difference um from then obviously i don't do much like foundation or concealer anymore and that's just because i want my skin to breathe and uh, especially in my teenage years i just don't want to be covering myself too much so i am going to be putting on half of this stuff on today which is a bit scary because my my Thing. my face hasn't felt like that for ages and then I'm going to be using some of my old stuff again which I'm so excited for I couldn't find two of the things so I'm going to have to settle for one of them is like something I did used to use a lot but like I'm going fully back to when I was like 9 and 10 um, which obviously was about 5 years ago so not 2020 <laughs> but you know what i mean um and then one of them is the exact same shade just in a different box and it's completely different anyway let's get into it so i'm gonna put this on this is my face mask headband i always put this on when i'm doing a face mask so you could literally use a snooze as well guys because that gets the hair off your face i just know that this is really good for it just not very good if your hearing aid is coming out <laughs> it pulls the hearing aid out but there we go <clears throat> if that keeps falling down please just just know i'm just waiting for my parents to come back uh, from being out and then i'm gonna change it so just ignore it if any of my hearing needs to start falling down very slowly <laughs> like that <laughs> so i'm gonna begin so i'm first gonna begin with i think we'll start with my older self and I'm going to be using something that I haven't used for a while, guys. And some of you, this is really going to be nostalgic for. It's going to be really nostalgic for me as well. And this is my CC cream. And I used this for ages. And this is in the shade Fair. I've still got a bit of it left, which is a bit weird because I thought I'd run out. But luckily I haven't, which means I can use it for these videos so I'll put a little bit on there because obviously we're only doing half of the face um, so I'm gonna do this face because it's just easier to do this side so I'm just gonna I used to do this a lot just put it in sections obviously I would do that side as well but <laughs> this is really weird because I used to do this like CC cream like in the nuts and crannies and it used to be so patchy because I couldn't like put it everywhere and I never used to put it all over my face so i apologize if this is patchy again i normally use a beauty blender but because i'm doing this half and half i'm using the same techniques as i did so yeah it is gonna look a bit weird because half my face is gonna be this color and half my face is gonna be that color because i don't use foundation and concealer that much anymore i occasionally do but i don't use it like all the time which is this is the makeup routine for that so i'm gonna do all of this side and then i'm gonna go to that side because i think that's just easier way of doing it 
I'm very excited for this. So now I'm gonna go in with this product and you guys haven't seen this come out in such a long time. This actually broke on me years ago. So I've had, got, got like loose salad table over it. But is this? Guys, we haven't seen this for ages. I wonder if it still smells how it used to smell because it smelled disgusting. So if you didn't know, you open it like that and that comes down and then that like opens up like that. <laughs> normally it just does it by itself but because i haven't used it in years then yeah so it's there's a chance this makeup won't be very good anymore but it doesn't matter i don't care <laughs> so yeah this is looking cute i've had this since i was nine years old i basically just use it as <laughs> as a highlighter And I used to just put it all over myself and put it like everywhere because I used to literally put it on like powder, didn't I? Sorry, this is getting like flashbacks here. You never used to see it on camera, so I doubt you'll be able to see it now. But it just gives you like a highlight. It's literally like a highlighter, but more subtle form. Um. So yeah, that's weird. <laughs> And it definitely still smells. <laughs> so now I'm going to put on some blusher. Now, I used to have this one. It's the exact same shade. But I couldn't find the other one. So I'm going to have to settle for this. I actually got this in my advent calendar last year. Um, and yeah, it's the exact same shade. It's just by Revolution instead of all on but yeah it's the same shade it was like this really bright pink i actually haven't used this one yet so i'm actually quite excited to try and give this a go yeah it's the same size it's the same shade sorry i used to make myself look really really like ill with it and then I would blend it out with my fingers like that and just leave it like that just to splodge in the face <laughs> um I'd now if I was doing a proper look I wouldn't just leave it there I'd probably do a bit on my nose on the tip of my nose or somewhere like that I wouldn't just have it there <laughs> I think that looks a bit ridiculous so there we go my routine like how I do my makeup like in stages is kind of the same as I used to do it so that's cool now I'm gonna do this now I couldn't find oh actually I used to use this all the time didn't I so <laughs> let's do this this is Superdrug uh it's Superdrug's own um brow styler in the shade i think blonde it's very minimal minimal i always thought it said boots but it actually does say super job and i literally just used to do that no brow gel oh flipping heck why am i being so silly today i'll wipe that off in a minute um and i literally just used to just go through my eyebrows i never really had a tactic for my eyebrows just used to just do that and there you go i look so funny right now because it looks like i've got so much makeup on this one and i literally have nothing on there but honestly when i have my half and half it's going to look even funnier so now i'm gonna use the palette who remembers this this wasn't from my like my first palette i cannot find that palette anywhere which is a bit of a worry but we're gonna go for this one because i did used to use these shades a lot so i'm gonna go these are the shades that i used to use first of all so i used to use this one and this one so i used to go off. and this was quite a look i think i, I think 
I think this was a lot. I don't know. And then I go into this one, which is... I used to use it as a highlighter a little bit, I think. But yeah, you just put it like that. There you go. Um, there you go. So then I used to do my mascara, which is the exact same mascara as I use right now. So I'm not actually going to use this one. I think it's gone completely, so I'm not even going to touch that one. So I'm going to use the one that I'm using at the moment. Because it's the same brand, it's the same shade. Literally, there's nothing different with it. So I'm just going to get everything out that I use now. So I'm now going to just do some mascara, they have changed the packaging but I promise you it's the exact same mascara as I used back then. And it wasn't much I used to do so I'm just going to leave it like that. I now try and fluff it up as much as possible. But I only used to do a tiny bit then, so, you know. Um, and then lips. That was literally all of my makeup routine. This is going to be weird because they are completely different shades. So it is going to be weird. But it used to be this bright pinky shade. Pinky purpley. I'm doing a half of this. Yeah, this is going to look weird. Doesn't that look weird? So I tried to just stick to one side. And that is how I used to do my makeup. That is weird. <laughs> Looking at that now, I literally can't even think that used to be how I did my makeup. That is like, wow, weird. So the makeup that I do now is completely different. So let's do this. So it's like makeup that I do for when I go to school is very minimal. minimal. And I don't really do a lot with my makeup. I don't use foundation or concealer at the moment. So I'm not going to do that now. But I actually just bought this. So I'm excited to see it. But I will be using it every day. So this is an eyebrow pencil. Just like the other one. I'm going to fill it in. So I'm first going to do the top. Just draw and measure. And then... The bottom and then fill it in like so. It looks so natural that one doesn't it? That one doesn't look natural but this one does. <laughs> then with my spoolie on the other end I'm just gonna do that. I'm nearly done. I haven't finished yet. I actually do use some brow gel and that's weird me even saying that because I never used to use brow gel, as you can tell. <laughs> so I just uh, put it through my brow. I don't know if that's a, something like a technical way of putting brow gel on, but that's just how I've done it. My brow is done. And then I use something called liquid eyeshadow and I'd actually got this in my advent calendar last year 
and it's really lovely it's a naturally color so what i do with this because i don't want to just put it on there because sometimes i do if it's like the weekend but when i'm going to school i can't have that like it's not natural enough so i get it i tap a bit on my finger and then i kind of control how much i'm putting on And there you go, that bit's done. Just gonna wipe that off. Blah, blah, blah. So now I'm gonna take my mascara. spaced out and I literally cannot see through my eye very much right now. Like it does that cloudy thing. I do get my brows really and I do brush it through so that it's all like completely different. Done. And my eyes and then what I do is I get my lip balm and this is a tinted lip balm but it doesn't really matter so I am going to put a bit of my tinted lip balm on I obviously don't do this like much makeup um, lipstick wise for school uh, I literally just put a lip barb on but you know I thought I'd do it right now <laughs> you guys it's literally 4 p.m when I'm filming this video um and then I'm gonna get my Rachel Friends Exit Revolution I think this is the darker shade or maybe it's the lighter shade I don't really know I really like this because it's really sticky and I really like sticky Makeup? I don't know. I'm really silly, aren't I? Yeah. And they basically look like the same, but I don't know. I feel like they don't look the same, really. But there you go. So, that is my makeup routine now. This is then. I love the natural look now i love that better than this because this going on isn't the best like the lashes yeah they're more natural than these but i still think that i like this one better because it's more natural and it doesn't take as much time because I, it's literally just putting this on um, my eyes and also there's no foundation or concealer or CC cream literally no base so I feel like I could prefer this way the blusher I'm not sure on how I've done it because like how why would I put it just in one place that's a bit silly to me but and then my eyebrow it's much darker on this side as it is on that side I feel like so yeah i'm i'm not vibing with this makeup as much so anyway guys if you want to go and see how i do my makeup properly like as a full face on my instagram go and have a look because honestly i really like this makeup but i hope you enjoyed and i will see you in my next video bye guys love you mm -hmm.